Hey guys, I'm Nate, and we're in my hometown of Toledo, Ohio, taking a look at one of the last remaining targets in my area that's all original from the late 80s to early 90s. Many of you already know, in the past few years, Target's been getting full updated remodels to bring their stores up to modern design and to compete with the likes of Walmart and other retailers. One of the iconic fixtures of old school stores like uh, Kmart and Target was the cafe. Now with the pandemic going on, this shut down back, I say, in the spring, and it looks like to be converted to a staging area for their holiday inventory. I took some photos of this cafe back in August of 2019, so let me show you what it looked like before it was closed down. Now this cafe specialized in Nathan's hot dogs where other cafes were uh, Pizza Hut Express, which others might be familiar with. And I just love the neon and colored tiles in here. It's that very late 80s, early 90s vibe to it. So you're probably asking what makes this target significant in terms of its vintage and style. And you're going to see that right now on the screen. It is all about the neon, baby. This neon goes the entire perimeter of the outside walls, as you can see here. And it really marks the store. It really dates it back to its, its vintage of uh, this store when it was built in 89. And this is what I love about it. The sad part is, is when they update these stores, the neon is taken down and replaced with pretty bland primer gray walls, um, which is one reason why I actually go out of my way to this target. Uh, this is not my local target. I actually head out this way because of just how it's preserved in a time capsule. Everything around it has been remodeled, redone, and this is the last target that's been hanging on and not converting. And it's really just a, a blast from the past to go back here and check things out.
Thanks for coming along with me, my little tour of Target, and I will catch you in the next video.